Borg. Um, I'm gonna send you some money. Because you are poor. Let's send you some cash. So if there is a war that breaks out, you won't instantly go bankrupt. Actually, that's not a bad point. Hold on. We could... We could switch... You don't even have to save and reload. We could just switch character to play as our son right now. Now, if our father, our, our own character, if King Andre remarries and has a son, that could screw some things up. But then we could go a murdering. I feel like I kind of want to play through right now, though. Go on a hunt. There's a chance to die there. I guess I could marry him to someone who is too old to have kids first. So, infertile. How come you're... Oh, because you're chaste. Fertility, fertility... Yeah, there's like some fertility mods going on here. Um, or you know what? We'll reset the default, but... Or by age. We'll find... We'll try to find someone age-appropriate for ourselves. But maybe with good stats. Actually, let's sort by... That's a good way. Let's sort by some of all skills. You. She's a genius. She's got stupendously good stats. Let's just do that. Yeah, she might die, and then we'll get more stress, and then we'll marry someone else old, and then she might die, and we might get more stress. And then maybe we'll just, you know, die from stress. If swapping rulers would be pretty good. Well, I mean, sort of, but it actually would be a lot of RNG, because we don't know what would happen with Scotland while we weren't babysitting it. Good there. Getting married. Yeah. Frank, you pretty big. We're trying to help it stay large, too. Got bits all the way over here. There, there. It's good. We got a foothold in Africa, which will be great for when we go towards air. <laughs> Bomb, have your father killed. Now, that would be the gamiest option. Married to her. Please don't cheat. Oh, she's shrewd? Holy crap! No wonder her stats are so good. Go, have beautiful children together. How's the scripture? Just quoting things. I'll memorize and recite a section on. On compassion. I'm literally compassionate. Mm -hmm. You could rename. Can you do that? Could I re inherit? I could restore the inheritance. I don't expect that the character would do so. Uh, he's in rough shape. He's in very rough shape. Well, I have to go open mind, unless I just go into another thing. Um, but no, I don't actually want to improve our court position stuff at all. Yeah, we'll just keep going on Scholar. Oh, we, we just... Um, uh, Balfacet, we've just been switching our titles around. No, nothing has really changed. We're just, we've got four kingdom titles, so we keep switching which one is our primary from time to time. As far as I know, it makes no difference. It does look a little bit better with Scotland, right? We were burgundy too long. We just swapped hats. Oh yeah, you want it? Let, let's go Wales. Let's finally give Wales some loving. There you go. We're Wales now. Oh, that, that brown is a terrible color. Not keen. Yeah, let's, um... Let's consider some warring, and we can lead things. Um, lead some duchy stuff, which isn't much. That's the same. Force vassalization. Oh, let's do this. And let's rally from here. And let's put us in charge. There. He's effing off again. He's probably going to go siege air. Although, I suppose... It's split in half. Leave the siege stuff. This one here, which I'm actually leading. 
we're gonna have you sit and defend uh, air that way. Yellow is definitely better. I think we can all agree. Yeah, we've technically had whales. It's great. It's lovely. But you know we gotta be Scotland. I mean, come on. Um. Now that is interesting. This might actually get us killed. God, they're sieging fast. What the shit, man? <laughs> I mean, because we weren't there, because we're leading the army, we can't instantly lose the war, luckily, by having our capital siege down. But holy crap. It's like them be like, what I should do when I start a war, should I just raise my army next to my capital and wait? Yeah, whatever. Uh, yeah, teach Charles. Yeah, the reinforcements came in time. Um, although potentially with some penalties. I think we're still going to lose, even though we theoretically went in with like double the troops. Because of the way they came in. Yes, we're wounded! It's so dumb that we would lose that fight because of the way things went. But that's okay. Alright, let's just go and de our capital. That's no good. Or we'll just throw ourselves directly back into the fight. Um, this is not me. Can I still lead? I know I'm wounded. There we go. Let's keep leading. Actually, I should probably... Oh, man. That is some war score they got for my capital. Man, they siege quickly. How many... 2.6 per day. Why does it say we're going to lose here? Better army qu commander, higher quality, more men at arms. Uh, we have three pips of quality versus their two. Oh, but they have two armies here. Yeah, it's probably showing me the stats for the army of Ovidio. Yeah, this is going to be fine. More injuries? Oh, we're just going to win. Yeah, they get 100% if they capture you. I guess they could capture me in battle. I hadn't considered that. They can't capture me from sieging me. Um, yeah, they're just going to run a bunch. Let's go and de-siege our capital here. Because that's obviously a lot of war score. And they've got someone prisoner. Oh, actually. Um... Match some siegers, come over here, and then come back. Are we not catching you? Go. I could be killed in battle, which would probably also make them win, which, I mean, I mean, who cares? We're not going to lose any land or anything from losing uh, the battles, or the, losing the war. We'd lose some the money and stuff. For like war reparations. Alright, control that. De siege this. Oh, they're coming back. Mm -hmm. If we lose the war, it's not the end of the world. De siege that. Go and fight these guys some more. Yeah, it really doesn't think we're going to do quite well. Yeah, the calculation on that screen is not accurate. Because it was telling us we were going to get wrecked. And it's like, disagree. Greater walls and towers. Because that siege timer is apocalyptically low. Perfect. We follow them right here. We both have the recently disembarked thing. We smash them around again and start the siege out of capital all at the same time. No one's here. No, good. Because we don't get any notification about hostile sieges, which is not great. 
Oh yeah, let's uh let's ask the Pope for some more money. Am I still wounded? Uh, wait. Oh shit! There's internal war in Francia. This is why I need to be in charge of Francia! He's losing a giant war for independence. Oh my god, he's bankrupt. I just done a bunch. And his grandson, ooh, handsome, is currently in prison. How many troops you got active? Like nothing. You have no hope. He won't accept me as an ally because of claims on territory. Oh, do I have the hook that I can do it with? Hold on. Yeah, you're right. Thank you. You moron! Let me in! Let me in! Um, yeah, I see. I shouldn't have started this war. You know, I was talking about like, oh, I'm just going to make sure to build up, make sure everything is good and stable and everything. This war here is stopping us from being able to help out our son adequately. I shouldn't have got into this at all. I should have just like had my troops raised inside of France. I wonder if I can just white peace real quick. Okay. I'm just going to white peace out of this war. Dang it. I'm not going to call Frankia into this war over here. I'm worried it might confuse things. And we finished fast. I'm going to have to siege out all of his territory here to do it. Ooh, gift subs. Um... Split. Problem is, his mother, the Empress, didn't have a terribly stable realm. Well, I don't think there was a lot of internal issues. But she was still pretty weak. Left war. Oh, that, that ticking too fast. It doesn't help. They've kidnapped. They've grabbed the air. That's fifty percent war score, just because they they hold on to the air. What is the war target? I wonder if there's a way to find out. Um, no, I don't. I don't want to become a witch right now. If if the war of independence goes, you know what? We'll just refight them later or something. Um. Mercs. Yeah, maybe I can check. Yeah, they're they're all sitting there. Um, I can summon mercs anywhere, right? I'll hate this interface. When I click where I want it to show up, yeah, there we go. Up here? No, wait, what? I guess you just got hired there. Um, that'll have to be okay. I'm gonna get this guy as well. I guess you just show up in the capital. Or you're here. I don't know why you're there, but sure. Can't see how many troops are actually in Paris. 7,000. 
Okay, land here first. That's done. Hey, Crusades are starting! Crusader Kings! It's like it's like what's on the box! Oh, I shouldn't have started this war. Okay, 100% there. Force demands, go. Good. Now you guys are also going to... Oh, I don't know where those troops are. Oh, those, those may have been the guys I was fighting this time. Okay, that's fine. Then what we're going to do is we're going to have everyone uh, show up over here. Get on your goddamn boats. Let's go. Go, go, go. Oh! Her husband must have died. She genius, right? Marry that guy. Congratulations. Rival died. Okay. Watch me die right now and then like everything just breaks all of a sudden. Okay. Smash the shit out of this guy. Uh, you're calling Crusade, huh? Um. I can't commit right now. Sorry. I've got other things to deal with. Done. Uh, one of the wars just ended. Wait, did I capture... I captured the queen! She was I guess she was leading her troops. I'm the best! <laughs> I'm the best at games! <laughs> uh yeah, I'm gonna totally join your second war. God, I'm the best at video games. <laughs> uh oh, and then there's another one. Okay. So there's a little Bohemia over there. Uh-huh. And then there's that. Alright. Oh, so good. Actually, maybe I should start with what's left of Bohemia over here, maybe? I don't know. We do have to wrap this up for today uh, shortly. Wow, that is a long walk. The attrition is going to be, like, and supplies. Oh, hold on. Let's actually chase down a red flagged army. And we could, well, okay, this is not like Crusader Kings 2. We don't have to disband the mercs. Uh, we paid for three years of mercs. Thank you. Um, we, we've got the mercs for three years. No need to disband them early. Incompetent Nestor's ruler has to call in daddy to clean up his mess. The problem is Frankia was already a mess. Frankia was in terrible shape. We had to, like, I mean, just look at what kept happening to the Empress, right? Horrible shape. Action created against me. So far, so good. I mean, put ourselves back in charge of the army. Well, actually, I want to make sure to have my, my, my proper commanders in charge of this because um, I kind of want to, you know, win this war. Oh my god. Got so many wars against Frankia. Uh, uh, oh, my granddaughter. Yeah, you know what? I'll do that. Stayed. Ending. It would be great to do. Map. Woman has been spending large amounts of gold and bragging loudly about a great deal she struck a fancy lord in pearls and silk. Uh, apparently she drew a map of the local plains for an unknown nobleman. The spies think the lord must be scheming against me and my subjects. I can become more vigilant, or the idiot belongs in a dungeon. I still become vigilant. I'd get some stress. Which, apparently, we're fine with. You know what? Go to jail. Smash this army. Secret exposed, some affairs, whatever. 
and ransom some more people, which is good, because apparently we can use some cash. Then we're going to go and smash this guy. Uh, I'm already doing my part fighting the infidels. I mean, I'm doing something. I really want to join the crusade, but it we can't right now. We absolutely cannot. Torture to find out who's scheming. I don't think I can, because I'm... Well, I suppose I can. I'm compassionate, but... And if we're not caring so much about stress, I don't even remember which one of these what it was. Was it Bourgogne L'Atelier? Two months. Two months. I don't remember which one of these it was. Queen Hildy of Bavaria. We're not giving you up yet. Wait a tiny bit longer. Guys, no. They're running fast. There we go. Crap out of you. You're, I'll beat the crap out of your reinforcements as well. That's fine with me. And then maybe become sieging here. Take this stack. Split you in half. Grab one of you and do this tribe. Okay. Torture all of them. Someone's plotting to kill me. You know what? Oh, that sounds awful. Um, Listen, um, Spymaster, I'm going to get you to uh, support schemes instead. Like, don't you want me to disrupt schemes? No, nope. it's fine. Although, maybe now would be a bad time to die. I'm really worried about... Although, the thing is, we will inherit... Like, Cyborg will inherit all the land in Scotland, which will help him a fair bit. Although, it might make things more chaotic. That is a lot of... Oh. Yeah, no. Like, we gotta free my daughter. My master, send him on vacation. We'll send him to, uh... We'll send him to Constantinople. The spy master's gonna be like... Uh, it doesn't work that way anymore. It's like, no, that's fine. There you go. I just inherited uh, the Duchy of Noroi, which we knew would happen eventually. Because that guy had no... He was married to someone who was too old to have kids. I'm going to use the Duchess over here. She is just much stronger. Um... Ba -da 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 -da. Grant some titles real quick. Yeah, it's fine. Thank you. Hey, it's a knight. Sure. Oh, one's a nephew. Hold on. Wait, doesn't he... This is a different Charles. Right, my nephew, not my not my son that is inherited. Okay. Um okay. Good, good, good. Smash, smash, smash. Staging there. Now, what is a 65% one? Oh, they want all of Provence, and that's Bohemia and things over here. I might want to start sieging in this area next. You. Oop. You. All right, we're going to have to put a cut in here. I thought we might be able to, like, deal with these wars um, all today, but we're going over, and I think there's going to be some more work to be done in general here. No. Sort of, like, it'd be nice to sort of um, focus on just one war and then piece people out little bits at a time. Wow, Poland is wrecked. Wrecked, wrecked, wrecked. Uh, but I'm not sure that's going to be much of a possibility. Son, are you still deeply in debt? Yeah, and getting worse? Yeah. On the bright side, if we win this war for, these wars for, I mean, we'll get money out of that, which is going to help. I could send some gifts, but it's not like I'm sitting on a bunch of cash either. Oh, I've got too many duchies. I do. Um. Okay, I don't actually have any war score from holding on any prisoners, including this queen. So, I think we can just go ahead and um, ransom off everyone we can for maximum cash. See how it goes. Or is it, I know I haven't died yet. It's crazy. 
Got that herbalist, which is partially helping things. My health is still poor. If I wasn't a herbalist, we probably would have kicked the bucket by now. On the other hand, maybe it's better that, you know, we've got a fairly stable internal realm and we can just help out over here more. I don't know. Populist uprisings. That's over here. That's not so bad. It's this war here. This is the one that's got the most war score. So fixing this. They've got the full, um, all the war gold sieged out. Although France is starting to desiege that, but it'll probably get crushed by battle here. But if I just siege them out at home, um, that'll be quite good. Oh shit, it's everything over here. I was gonna say, that doesn't make any sense. No, because I was gonna say, where's the big thing? I can't really siege out their home base. I should probably, especially since we're out of supply, change of plans. We're going to come over here. We're going to walk through friendly territory, regain our supply. And then once we get here, we can smash some of these armies and help besiege some stuff as well. That's the new plan. Maybe, you know, walking through this along the way. And end up over here or something like this. I don't know. All right, folks, we're going to put a cut in here. We're going to be continuing this uh, probably on Saturday. I think Saturday is also going to have something else on Saturday. Uh, details to come at a later date. Saturday, I think, will be half CK3, half another ting. Herbalist trust. Oh, uh, oh, you're right. It's only countering penalties from disease. It doesn't actually increase your base health. Okay. Well, you know, less bad, I suppose. Um, folks, we're going to wrap it up here. Thanks a lot for watching. And unless I am wrong, I think A Kiss for Luck is actually streaming herself today. Check her channel. See how it is. Uh, oh, no, it's Rhino. He is still playing some Crusader Kings. If you want more Crusader Kings, go ahead. Well, we're going to raid a Kiss for Luck channel. Otherwise, I'll see you guys on Saturday. See you, folks. Bye-bye. Rhino Scotland. Ooh. Not going to be as good as my Scotland, though. French Scotland. French Scotland is best Scotland, right? Exactly. All right, see you, folks. Bye-bye.